Welcome to Movie Magic Scheduling. Today we're going to go over navigating the program and the interface. Here are some of the functions you'll use during your process. You could be breaking down your script and discover you need to add a sheet. Clicking this button allows you to add a sheet to your breakdown. As you click the icon, notice the sheet count increases. The Merge Sheet icon allows you to merge two sheets that are similar, which could possibly cut down on the schedule. The Duplicate Sheet icon allows you to duplicate information from one sheet to another. This function is convenient when you need to spread a scene out over multiple days. The Delete key deletes all information. If possible, send it to the Boneyard instead of deleting unless you're absolutely sure you want to remove the information. The Renumbering icon is used to renumber sheets once they've been arranged in the order in which you'd like them to be. This icon will be activated when you have changed your sheet numbering preferences from automatic to manual. The navigation arrows will move you through the script. The double left arrow will take you to the first page, and the double right arrow will take you to the last. The single left and right arrows will move you through the entire document. The hide categories icon will hide blank categories. We encourage new users not to hide any category, as you may discover you need to use one at a later time. The element quick entry icon allows you to enter elements into the breakdown sheets. Element linking lets you take an anchor element and link different elements to that anchor. So while scheduling, you can enter the anchor element and all attached elements will follow. Red flag entry will allow you to manage your conflicts. Navigate by lets you choose how to navigate through your schedule. Sheet numbers are automatically populated once you enter in the scene number for your script. You typically get one breakdown sheet per scene. Interior exterior is for notating a scene's location, and if it's an interior or exterior location. Set refers to the set in the script. Day-night is for the time of day the scene occurs. Pages lets you know how many pages this scene is in the script. It breaks the script down into eighths. For instance, if the scene takes place in four eighths, that's about half a page. Synopsis is a short summary of what's happening in the scene. Script page lets you know which page the scene is within the script. Script day, for continuity purposes, helps you identify where you are in the actual story. Unit is the first, second, or customized unit. Sequence refers to a particular sequence, dream, or flashback. Location is the physical location of the scene. For scheduling purposes, you can notate that here. Estimated time lets you know how long you're shooting at a location or what the production time is estimated to be. The comments section is reserved for any notes you'd like to make regarding your breakdown sheet. And that's navigation and interface in Movie Magic Scheduling. Thanks for watching.